Y'all get ready? Yes, you get ready. Shout out to all my tea sippers out there. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because you already know this tea is what? Piping hot. All right, so if you guys do not know, everybody's favorite reality TV show, Father. <laughs> And I use that word lightly. Um, Peter Guns is trending number one on social media, okay? So this entire situation is crazy. When I seen him trending, I'm like, Lord, please don't tell me Peter Guns done had a damn heart attack from fucking, okay? Well, that wasn't what was going on. What happened is that media takeout and several news outlets are now reporting that Peter Gunn has knocked up a 19-year-old teenager, okay? So basically, his 19-year-old girlfriend, they're stating that she's currently pregnant with his 11th child, okay? This is going to be his sixth baby's mom. Now, we all know Peter Gunn's from all that fuck shit he was doing on VH1 with Tyra Wallace and also Mina Butterfly. He ended up knocking up both ladies at the same damn time. Tara had one baby with him. And then Amina had a baby with him. And then Tara got pregnant again, I believe. And then Amina, they was literally playing tit for tat with his damn sperm, okay? So that was like one of the most controversial Love and Hip Hop New York um, seasons ever. So now it's being reported that he's knocked up a 19-year-old, which is crazy because his oldest son, Corey Guns, who's also a rapper, he used to be signed to Young Money, he's in his 30s. So this woman is young enough to be his daughter, okay? Peter is in his 50s. And so a lot of people have been dragging him on Twitter, on Instagram. This entire situation is a hot damn mess. Y'all go ahead and look at these tweets, these comments, and what folks had to say. Check this out, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. All right, so you guys just saw all of those comments. So this is what the blogs are reporting. They're stating that they had reached out to somebody from VH1, and this is what the producers are saying. They're saying, we're considering re-adding Peter to the cast of Love & Hip Hop New York. There are recent developments in his life that would be interesting to fans. This arrives after Peter's estranged wife, Amina Butterfly, hinted that he was planning to marry his much younger girlfriend. So how everything came to be is that basically, um, he was going live on Instagram, and Amina jumped into the comments and was going off so this is what Amina was saying Amina was saying you don't got to show her to this mean world out here but you can admit you're dating a younger woman while you're at this topic especially when you're planning on marrying her while we didn't finalize the divorce then she goes on to say yes Peter needs to turn the papers into the courts but he hasn't meanwhile he's engaged new lol so because of what Amina wrote during the live stream, a lot of fans are putting two and two together and stating the only reason why he's running to marry this 19-year-old is because he knocked her up. And a lot of folks are just disgusted by this. I mean, this guy is old enough to be this girl's grandfather. You know, um, the whole situation is really crazy. But I did go on to Peter Guns' Instagram and so on his Instagram page, he was stating that he was going to go live today and talk about everything at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Now, I've been on his page off and on all day, and he has not gone live. So I don't know what's going on with that. I don't know if he's holding back, if he doesn't want to talk about it, but he has not gone live today to address it. All right, so after waiting damn near six hours 
for Grandpa Guns to speak out about this whole teenage pregnancy situation, he did finally go live. And he was using his kids that he has with Tara to go live. I guess he needed them for comfort. But basically, he's stating that he did not get a 19-year-old pregnant. After the fact, he also did a live stream. And once again, Thirsty Ass Amina Butterfly was there to question him about the pregnancy as well. And once again, Peter Guns also denied knocking up the 19-year-old. So, you know, at this point in time, I think it's a rumor. It may be a lie. But like Amina says, when it comes to Peter, you just never know. So anyways, y'all go ahead and try out these videos. I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. So everybody that said just put some hot sauce on this thing. Nigga come back and ask me to put some more on his thumb. Hold his thumb up. That don't work, right, bam? Yeah. Tell him also, also. My daddy don't deal with 19-year-old girl. That's it. Bronxy's my last sister. My sister. The end. The end. Stop spreading these rumors. Stop spreading these rumors. Alright? Smack fire out you. Shut, shine yeah, yeah. Stop, stop messing with my daddy. We know my daddy was a bad boy. He's better now, right? Daddy's a good boy now, right? Who you love? Who you love? Who's Bam Bam? Daddy Bam Bam. Who Bam Bam? Daddy Bam Bam. Daddy Bam Bam. That's right. Juice. Somebody come help Juice with his homework. This shit got me twisted. Somebody help me help my son with his homework. homework. Say later. We out of here. Later. We got to go get the milky from school. Get milky from school. <laughs> I missed the whole. No, I was just the telling whole... people the rumor that you pregnant from an 18 year old ain't true. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> I'm just bad. Now, what about your rumor? Yeah, I was addressing that rumor. Is it a rumor? I don't know if you that you are not that she see what I'm saying. Is it no. a rumor? Or no. Would you ever? Would you think I would date somebody Brandon's age? Well, I with you, I don't know shit. I, <laughs> anything's uh -huh. possible. Well, then that that's why you live in California and I live in New York and we ain't together. Because if you think if you think that about me, then I you know. But this entire situation is a hot damn mess. At this point in time, Peter Gunn just needs to go on ahead and go get a vasectomy, okay? He already has 11 children by six different women. 11! That's how many! 11! How much more kids do you need to have, okay? He can barely take care of these younger babies that he has. And I'm not talking about financially. I'm talking about being able to, you know, be there for them when they wake up, get them ready for daycare, changing diapers. He's not doing any of that shit. He's leaving all the responsibility on these women. And, you know, the fact that this 19-year-old will come into a situation and allow herself to get pregnant by Peter Guns, knowing how many kids he has, knowing all the, you know, the drama that he's had on Love and Hip Hop with all his multiple baby mamas, it's insane you know so sometimes you know these these women they get themselves into situations as well knowing the type of man that they have but they swerping down there's gonna be something about their cooch that's gonna change that man and that shit never happens okay so i want to bring you guys both sides so i know a lot of people are running with the story that he knocked up the 19 year old but peter is saying that he did not this is a rumor so i don't know if they're trying to create a storyline we all know they're desperate to get back on love and hip-hop new york so i'm not sure where they this came from but right now peter guns is definitely trending all over social media so this entire situation is a hot damn mess and i'm gonna tell you like this if it does come out later on that there's a 19 year old woman who's pregnant by him I don't feel bad for her because everybody knows what Peter Guns is about. So if you allow yourself to get into a relationship with Peter Guns and you allow yourself to get knocked up, that is on you, okay? Anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire messy-ass situation. Once again, concerning Peter Guns allegedly knocking up a 19-year-old, but he's not denying it. And then how do you guys feel about Amina Butterfly? Like, just being all up in the mix and, you know, questioning him. You need to follow the hell back and let him live his damn life okay she's starting to come off really really thirsty popping up on all his live streams always having something to say about him but claiming she's moved on to bigger and better things well man we can't damn tell okay so anyways y'all let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces